Hello, Hello, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Thank you for welcoming me into your beautiful home. You're welcome. <laughs> Enter. Thank you. This is a gorgeous open space. Thank you. Yes. I, I've heard a rumor that this is your favorite room. This is my absolute favorite room in my house. Um, yeah. I love food, so I spend most of the time my time in here. And uh, I see you brought a friend with you. Can you tell us a little bit about who this who this gorgeous girl is? Yes, this is my dog Nala. Um, we've had her for three years, and uh, she thinks she's human, so um, I always have to baby her. So tell me about this room. You mentioned this is one of the rooms you spend a lot of time in. Why is that? Well, uh, I'm very fortunate to to have uh, a brilliant chef. Um, who is my wife. She's an amazing cook and uh, I spend a lot of time in here um, watching her cook. Uh, so I'll sit on the, the um, stool there and uh, watch her go to work. Um, you know, we're big foodies, so food is very important in our life. And uh, Do you help out at all? I help out as much as I can. Um, usually it's uh, chopping things. So and, you're the sous uh, chef? And, and getting things and uh, organizing her, her uh, her ingredients. The dining room where yeah, we usually eat our meals. Um, so it's yeah, this is probably the second most uh, used room uh, as well as the living room. So uh, we spend most of our time on this floor. And do you ever host any of the other guys over or? Oh yes. Uh, we're big into uh, having people over and um, we like to uh, play games. Um, whether it's Jenga or uh, Cards Against Humanity. I love that um, game. We, we usually love to, to uh, host people, and uh, we I guess people like coming over. So Does that include some of the other players? Yeah, most, most of the, my teammates will come here um, if uh, we're not going out uh, in the city to hang out. Good. So let's talk about you know playing soccer and being on the field. I understand that in 2010, you actually were headed for the American team in the World Cup and then and then you had a tragic accident. Can you tell me about what happened? Yeah, um, it was basically um, I was at my all-time high um, uh, as a soccer player um, going to Honduras uh, playing in a World Cup qualifier uh, knowing that if we won that game we would qualify for the World Cup which which we did so wow. um, as a child as, as, a, as a young professional soccer player your dream uh, your end all be all is to to make a world cup and uh to finally have it basically in in your grasp and then uh two days later um ended up being in a car accident and uh realizing you a week later that you have a, a broken femur broken tib fib um broken out broken dislocated elbow um uh, a bladder that was um burst um, my goodness and uh, a whole lot of face uh, bone bone uh, breaking in my face and and uh, brain bleeding so uh, it was a whole bunch of surgeries uh, a long recovery how long and, was the uh, recovery I mean you're obviously fully recovered and you're <laughs> playing again which is remarkable after what you went through how, how long did that take as far as recovery goes I was in the I was uh, I guess I was fortunate I was only in the hospital for about a month and uh, as soon as I got out of the hospital, it was straight rehab, probably eight hours a day um, wow. for as long as I could last, you know, without feeling like I was going to faint. Um, that was, was the hospital here? Uh, the hospital was in Washington, D.C. Okay. Um, and so I was very fortunate to have great doctors kind of put me back together again. Uh, it was basically like Humpty Dumpty. Um, and uh, I'd say probably two years. Um, it took me to, to really get back to being able to play soccer and, and feel normal again. That's um, amazing. I mean, I think, you know, medicine has come so far. Do you think if this would have happened to you, you know, say 20 years ago, you would have had this <laughs> remarkable recovery? Uh, I'd say the chances would be slim. Uh, well, that was so fun. Thank you again. You're welcome. Uh, also, I have uh, my shoe, my uh, Nike shoe collection. Oh, okay. Yeah. Let's check it out. Whoa, that is quite a collection. What's your favorite pair if you had to pick? Um, yeah. 
It's tough. Uh, I don't know. I love red, as you can probably see, but uh, what's what's the newest pair? It'd probably be these are my favorite of all time. Let's see. Very cool. They're called uh, the Air Yeezys. So it was called the Championship Series because uh, this was his, I think, first ring, and um, these are are the champagne and the cigar. Very cool. Mm -hmm. 